Hello guys, it's Hansel the Dev here and in this video today I just want to tell you guys about a new video series I'm starting it's called Motivation for Programmers you know as a programmer there are some difficulties people pass through being a developer that uh, some programmers are not open to talk, to talk to about and I want to be able to be that person who brings out those issues talk about what programmers face, how to motivate yourself because as being a self-taught developer it's not easy, it's, it's a very tiring journey, I, it has been rough. To where I am, I'm still a young guy struggling to, to, to keep up with the pace of the technology advancement but the, when you just get into the field it becomes so, so overwhelming. I mean, you feel you feel like you cannot be you cannot be competent enough to carry on that dream of you of becoming a programmer. Every day you sit on your device, you're subscribed to top YouTube channels, and you get a notification from, let's say, no offense though, you see a notification from Travis C Media, you see it from Khan Academy, you see it from Freeco Camp, you see it from Tech with Team, you see it with Dev Ed, and. You, you get all these random notifications from different channels talking about hey yo build this application in two hours time get to make a web application how to use rest apis how to use django what is the latest technology which programming language to use and it's it's so much the pressure becomes too much to contain so that's why in this video series i'll be helping you to walk you through out of that video. We're gonna be talking about things like tutorial poetry. We're gonna be talking about how to use project-based approach in order to be able to beat tutorial poetry. And we'll also talk about things like how to organize yourself as a developer, how to make your, your workflow to increase productivity. We we'll talk about things like burnout. So programmers, after maybe because they want to compare themselves with others, they find themselves working too much than they are required. In programming, you don't need to be coding 12 hours a day, 6 hours a day, no, you do according to your time. There are people who are older here, who have families to take care of, they have other mediocre jobs to do. So since they have other jobs to take care of, they can't spend like 6 hours like I can. So all these topics, all these difficulties programmers face, it's what I'm about to bring to you on my YouTube channel. I thought of bringing making YouTube tutorials, it will come up subsequently. I feel like this is a field or a part of programming or a part of videos on YouTube that is really talked on, talked on about how to motivate programmers. Every day when you scroll through the comments from different YouTube channels, you see people being depressed because they cannot accomplish what those guys are showing the video. But actually the reality is different. The reality of those YouTubers is they actually sit down, they start nagging their heads on the screen and figuring out how to do that stuff. It's not like you just sit out of a blue and you're a God programmer and you start typing and you're typing and you're typing and things are just flowing. Oh, the code. Oh, that. Oh, that. No. So, please, this video series will help you guys to get you on the right track. So, I hope you're going to love this series and I hope you will be able to follow it up and I hope you'll do a great job to motivate you in your journey to become a programmer please if you haven't subscribed please make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel smash the like button and so that you can keep up to date to my upcoming videos on the motivation for programmers without further ado see you in the next series of motivation for programmers